Hello everyone, hi, welcome to the channel of Wall Street Mojo. If you are new to this channel, then don't forget to subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for all the latest updates. Welcome everyone. Today we have a topic with us is called the mid Excel function. This is a text string function in Excel. We'll try and learn this in a much more detailed format. Let's try and get into the nitty gritty of the same. Now, before we start the function, I would like to take you to do some concepts which will help you to resolve uh, to understand this formula. So the mid function is, is is categorized as a text function in Excel and it is used to extract the substring from the middle of the string. So mid in Excel returns a specific number of uh, characters or what we call as the substring. Okay, can be any of the thing from a string that is based on starting point and the number of the character that is specified by you. In simple words, uh, the mid uh, function the mid function in Excel is used to extract a very small part of the string uh, from the input string or returns a uh, return a required number of the character from the text of the string how does this formula exactly work you can start writing is equal to mid just open up this by saying mid the mid formula in Excel has three com uh, compulsory parameter that is uh, text start number number characters now what are the compulsory parameters the text it is the text from which you want to extract uh, the substring the start number is the starting point position of the substring and the num characters is the number of the characters of the substring how to use this mid function in excel so the mid in excel is very simple and easy to use let's understand uh, the working of the mid function in Excel by some of the mid formulas uh, uh, example, and we'll be able to figure out uh, details in a in a more explanatory fashion. See, in, in this mid, in the first example, yeah, in this mid formula example, we are fetching the substring from the given uh, text string by using the mid formula in Excel. We'll start with saying is equal to mid, okay, and uh, we'll be seeing this text string that is um, visible in front of us. The, the the formula here uh, is as simple as that the mid then the text then comma and it says what is the start number that you want so i'll say two i'll say two and uh, what is the number of the characters i'll say five close the bracket so you'll get anuj so starting from the second and uh, you on five as uh, the string so just drag this down control d so you'll get inish ohit so it, it starts from the second letter because that's what we have specified we can just do start with one so it, it says full name uh, just drag it down so it will dinesh so this is how you know you can change the formula and you know do some permutation combination to get a fantastic answers let's do example number two here now before that if you change this number characters over here instead of x so over here where there was a problem uh, where the full name was not there you are able to fetch things out example number two now we can use a mid function uh, the extract the first name and the last name uh, from the full name so for the first name uh, we have used the mid formula in excel that is is equal to mid we can say is equal to mid the full name tanuj starting text is uh, starting number is one okay and we'll use another formula called search inside use two comma select the name tanuj rajput comma the number of uh, the characters that's uh, going to be one okay we'll have to do it again is equal to mid okay we'll select the full name comma one mid the full name comma one inside that uh, we'll say search search what 
so we need to find text comma within the text we want uh, what is going to be within the text and the starting number is one close double bracket that's it so you get a t as the answer had it been over here too it will change accordingly control d if you if you just write five you'll get full tanuj here okay so you know for the last name we can use something like this is equal to mid and uh, again the text is going to be b17 of that we want to search something open the bracket comma yeah within search the you select b17 here within the text the number that you want here starting from is uh let's say just once you have selected the b17 close the bracket start number character is 100 close it so you'll get the uh the full full value here of uh, uh what we call as the full name had it been you 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 haven't used the full thing you know rather than that what you can uh, do sometimes is that just select 10 here so tanuj rajput okay so this is how uh, you can uh, fetch the data to get the things worked up now uh, in the mid function of excel example number three suppose that we have to find out the block from the id which was located after let's say within one distance uh we'll try and understand uh, how this uh, portion work as you can see a1 hyphen b2 id so we want the mid over here we'll start with mid mid uh select the text here h3 in that find find text hyphen use hyphen okay this is what you want from where so you will say from h3 uh, close the bracket plus the starting number one number of characters you want uh, let's say two close the bracket and you will say b2 as the id control d so you'll say b3 b3 over here b5 and so on and so forth right so i hope you are able to understand what we are trying to achieve here now before we end up this video i want you guys to learn the some of the things that you should remember uh, about the mid function in excel see the excel mid function returns the empty text okay if the start number is if the start number is let's say greater than the length of the string so you will say is equal to mid here then the start uh let's say b3 just write b3 here comma let's say 21 comma 5 you get nothing so the blank right so blank as a start number is greater than the string length so as the output will be blank right now if the start number is let's say less than the length of the text but the start number plus the number character exceeds the length of the string then the mid returns the character up to the end of the text right now if you are not able to understand let's go to tanuj again to our example here well in this particular scenario what you can do is simple is equal to mid the text is b3 comma 1 comma 15 and you get the full name as tanuj rajput right because you have entered to the maximum now the mid function through the value error if it starts less than one okay then what will happen so instead of this just simply write is equal to mid 
the text is going to be the same comma uh, you will see the number of starting number minus one and uh, say 15 so you will get a value error because that's not something excel is looking out for uh, you, it cannot be minus one right and uh, had it been over here instead of this if you take minus 15 again it's gonna be the same scenario value error so that's it for this particular topic if you have learned watching this video do not hit do not forget to hit the like button share this video and uh, subscribe this channel press the bell icon for all the latest updates thank you everyone